The students is filing a civil rights complaint with the University of Texas. They say this happened during a discussion about the Israeli-Palestinian conflict and accuse a professor and doctoral student of physically intimidating them. KV's Amber Downing is live on campus, new at 6. Amber. Terry, the group says the university, and specifically a professor and a doctoral student, discriminated against them. University President Gregory Fenves spoke with us earlier about the situation, but first let's get a little background on what happened. Now, you saw this video earlier at the start of the story. UT's Institute for Israeli Studies hosted a discussion about Israeli military culture. The Palestine Solidarity Committee wanted to comment about the event, something they say they have gotten permission from the Dean of Students to do. But they're stopped when a doctoral student rips the flag away from them. Later, a professor published the student's names. Famed my character and insinuated that my political opinions and expressions represent red flags for terrorist activity. The University of Texas has a legal obligation to protect the First Amendment rights of its students. The university has a duty to protect its students from discrimination. Any type of disruption, in my view, is not constructive, and uh, we, try to, we try to promote constructive dialogue in, in all our settings. President Fenves spoke with us about what happened, saying while he hadn't seen the video himself, free, free speech has a big place on UT's campus. He says he has teams of people investigating whether any school rules were broken, but for now, campus police say there will not be any charges. No one will be charged with the crime. Now, the group's attorney says they hope to settle this with just a civil complaint, but they're not ruling out a lawsuit. Live at UT, Amber Downing, KVU News.